Typhoon Nieto has came off its peak and is now a Category 3 Typhoon again on the Sapphire Simpson scale, currently at 23.8 degrees north and 142.3 degrees east. Nieto has peaked as a Category 4 Super Typhoon yesterday night. Uh, currently, Nieto has winds of 125 miles per hour, a central pressure of 946 millibars. It is moving northeast at 24 miles per hour and there is no CDPS rating due to it far away from land. So the size of Nyoto is actually quite moderate for a fish storm in the western pacific on this type of month. The largest quadrant is now the southwestern quadrant uh, which stretches 170 nautical miles from the center. Uh, currently Nyoto is 151 miles from Okasawawa Islands, a 45 miles from Guam, uh, 912 from Kagoshima, South Japan, 804 miles from Osaka, Japan, and 737 miles from Tokyo, the capital of Japan. So you can see from the distances in miles and also the map we're showing just uh, how far away Nieto is from any uh, major landmass that could be affected by any tropical cyclones. So the agencies are mostly agreeing with the JDWC's est estimates of 125 miles per hour for Nieto, but the GMA is slightly lower at 115 miles per hour. But uh, I should say that the uh, 150 miles per hour is from 10 minutes of staying wind, so it ratio to about 125 miles per hour in one minute. Here's the latest comb. Um, it is expected to become post tropical. Uh, very shortly, about a day or a day and a half. Therefore, there is not much to be looked at. Uh, it has came off its peak of 150 miles per hour. Sea surface temperatures is uh, moderate for tropical cyclones. Uh, however, as near to uh, reach reaches more higher latitudes, uh, sea surface temperatures will. Uh, will be dropping and not favorable for Nieto at all. The models are in a general consensus of rapid weakening right now. Deep layer shear is and has been uh, rising now already at 25 knot. Uh, sea surface temperatures is expected to drop and mid level relative humidity uh, going actually very dry at 40%. So this is a satellite loop. Uh, at around last night, um, around 24 hours ago, uh, showing that it's uh, approaching to peak. You can see that the CDO just wraps around its side with very high uh, temperature cloud tops. Uh, but looking back at the uh, satellite right now, you can see that the CDO is trying to hold itself, but um, seemingly failed to do so. It is moving very fast, uh, indicating a uh, extratropical transition very shortly, and uh, ending Nieto's life as a very surprising major typhoon uh, in the month of in the month of November this year, where there is nothing of major hurricanes. So I guess there's a surprise out of this.